you know, if one stray cannonball comes by and whips my shaman, it's just a null kill for me, so it's just kind of a waste, in my opinion. Oh, I got it! I got it! I got the Warhammer! I got the Warhammer! What the Bingo balls. KC 155? 1 in 5k drop, man. What the f I just couldn't resist the opportunity to put in such a hype clip at the start. Just had to. Just had to. So I'm going to I'm going to wind it back and go a bit more chronologically here, but that happened pretty close to the beginning of the episode anyway, but enjoy guys. And here is 1k kill count. 1000 kill count. I've never had a I've never had a boss kill count that high before. Oh, yeah, boy. Dang. That was a 48 kill trip. That is by far my longest trip. If I didn't bring Karenborn and I brought some shark, shoot man. If I brought some mana ray, shoot man. I would have gotten like 60 kills. I would have gotten like 98 kills, man. No, 48 though. That's crazy, dude. What? Quick shout out to Lord Edward here. I didn't realize that Kraken doesn't have any uh, doesn't have a magic level, so you actually don't need magic accuracy. So I've sort of revised with what I have here for maximum magic defense and magic offense, of course, or magic uh, damage, not accuracy. So a little late in the task for it, but thank you, Lord Edward. Never killed lizard shamans before, and I got myself a juicy, juicy task. I'm excited for this, boys. I'm excited for it. So I guess this is it. You just kind of hang out, and then when they put the purple guys on you, you just run away. This guy, I don't even think this guy summoned purple guys on me. I just got, I just got the Warhammer. I just got the Warhammer on my first uh, task. I just got, I just got the Dragon Warhammer on my first Lizardman task. I have 150 kills, I think. Here, let me talk to this guy. What the? What? What the hell? Oh my god! I was like joking with myself about, you know, I'm never gonna get it, and how many have I killed? What the f***? How many have I killed? 162. Uh, while I was making not too many bolts, just some, just a handful here, I noticed something kind of weird. So I'm just gonna hold space, click, and just like about once a tick, I guess. Look, you can like you can just destroy them like that. Oh, look at that! Look at that! <laughs> this is the normal speed. Mer, mer, mer. Instead, I go like this. Yeah, boy. Yeah, that can actually be. That can. That can probably be decent magic X speed. Forkath is such a fun boss. I really don't have that many kills on him. I think I stopped at about fifteen. I got a blue dragon task, so I'm killing him again. Granted, you know, you don't use the Slayer Helm because Salve is better, and I need to wear my Serp Helm anyway, so I'm, ha I'm having fun with him. Uh, you, d you get a bunch of prayer experience and a bunch of crafting experience from him. I've gotten a few dragon plate legs already and uh, just like five kills, so it's, it's cool, man. I, I'm, in I'm enjoying it. I this boss is really fun. Kill 22, I got the Vorkath's head again. So I guess I can color my helmet blue now, but uh, I definitely don't have the Slayer points for that. It looks pretty cool. I think I saw people using it with um, like ancestral robes and stuff. I think it matched that pretty well. But yeah, this is the first time I've had, aside from when I got it for the assembler, I wasn't going to waste it on that. This is the first time I've gotten one of the items to color the Slayer helm. It'll probably sit in my bank for a while. Go! One more! Yes! Yeah, boy, it did it without eating, son! <laughs> yeah, I love it, I love it. The Void Melee Helm is the only Void Helmet that I need, and then I'll have all three. And I have Elite as well, from, I uh, believe that's Western Provinces Hard. Yeah, so I've had Elite for a while, with Ranged and Mage. I've sort of been getting the helmets in a slow trickle. Took me forever to get the Mage Hood after the Ranged, and now it's been 
God knows how long since I've really been in here. So it's kind of nice doing it like that, though. Like getting 200 points here and there isn't too bad, especially now that I'm on the higher level boat. It's really fast. It's 40 games for 200 points, which you can do in you know less than two hours. This is my last game for the Void Melee Helm. 200 points. Let's go Let's go snag that helm. Okay, confirm Void Knight Melee Helm. Boom. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, so if I ever come back here, it'll be for, I think, prayer experience. Some Iron Men do here. That won't be for a while if I choose to do that. For the most part, I think I'm straight legit for raids. I gotta get some of my friends together. That is 96 defense and 123 combat. I was really close after that, after those pest control games, so I figured I'd throw on my new fancy hood and just come knock that out really quick. I think I was like, I don't know, 20k away or something, so it just took a minute. Got 203 personal best. I've been trying out the blowpipe um, and just having two out of three forms of protection and the dps just is worth it seems like the dps is just worth it and it helps that the dragon warhammer spec stacks so if you land both of them it does 50 percent of their defense rather than just 30 which is pretty awesome it, it stacks but it's not accumulative so it's not 60 percent if that makes sense dang man i just tied my personal best was not clean by any means it, it would have been my personal best if i didn't make some mistakes like i didn't uh range potion at the very beginning of the fight and i ran over a little bit of goo i got a little gooey still happy with it though that is another vorkath's head just love it this is my fourth one how cute how do we do battle staffs nice drop if i do say so kill number 100 i can dig it was a full blue dragon task over at vorkath so I think I worked out, it was something like ranged XP, that is. And I banked over, at the bare minimum, 250k prayer XP. But I'm going to say maybe 300, 350k, because aside from the superior bones, he also drops the noted dragon bones. It's not going to be a whole shitload, you know? But it is a, it is a fair little bit. Um, yeah, so we're looking just under 2.5 mil for... Alk alkable status, but it looks like I'm just shooting it over it. I'm just stabbing this thing in his head, man. Ow! Ow! Just quit, quit stabbing me in the head, man. Mission success. <laughs> oh, you can't teleport out of here. Dupes. I forgot to mention that I've never done Sire before, so this was a new experience to me. It was really fun. Well, that was very, very sloppy. Oh. <sighs> that was cool, though. I did that one without any um, food. It's going to be a matter of me kind of using my prayer a little more effectively, I think, and I... Should be pretty good. Okay, we got an unsired. We got ourselves an unsired on kill count 14. Pew, 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 pew. That's what I'm talking about. I don't really know what I want. I don't really know what I want from this. Kind of made a mistake of not showing me throw it in, but my first unsired turns into the bludgeon spine. Is Does this have a money value? No, it has a high alk value, though. Second kill of the morning. It's a nice 6.05 a.m. drop for me. Got our second unsired at kill count 42. We can get another bludgeon piece, maybe get a pet. Let's let's do it right. Oh. Oh, coming in with the abyssal dagger. Cool, look at that. That's so hot. It's so hot right now. Need to get some poison, bruh. Cool. I'm not not sure where I use it, but damn, that is so sexy, though. 
I've made it up to 55 kill count over at Sire. I'm gonna finish this task at Abyssal Demons and Catacombs and try to get some more charges for the Arc Light. I have like just 188 left. I'd rather not use them all. And I know I could use the spear there, but I would like to get some more shards. Would really like to. So, Abyssal Demon tasks are weighted so heavily anyway. I'm not really worried about getting more Abyssal Demon tasks. It'll happen pretty quickly, I'm sure. But yeah, that was so much fun killing Sire, man. That was so much fun learning that fight. I definitely have some room for improvement, but that's just awesome. It's really fun. I highly recommend, if you haven't tried them, go, go try it out, man. Try it out. Piss on me, beat me, try it out. I got myself the Dark Claw. I, I'm i a little surprised that I haven't seen it earlier, but that's awesome. Oh, that's super cool. I'm so happy to get another item to color the helmet. I feel like I didn't have any of them for so, so long. Only recently, you know, I got the Vorkath heads. I'm not sure if I want to wear the purple one, but I'm, yeah, I'm happy to get that, man. Cool. That was my last kill of a trip here. And got myself uh, another tentacle. So I got a one for the bank there. This is my only spare. But only nine more and I get a really super, super big trident. Oh, how cool. I'm on an Aber Inspector task now. It's a nice place to do some alking. I'm going to do these earth orbs and the random rune items I got from Sire and a couple other tasks. I've never done prayer training at the I've never done prayer training in the wilderness like this before and I was thinking I would use the rock cake to get myself dead really quick but I think because it's untradeable and I'm past level 20 I would have to get it back every single time what I'm going to do is just run over to the chaos fanatic that's over there and I just did it once and he kills me pretty quick I'm running into a lot of PKers. I'm just going to do this in the early morning when I wake up because this is kind of annoying. I'd rather just not deal with that. I did, however, get a prayer level. <laughs> bonum, 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 medium casket. Another medium clue coming in from that Dagonoff task. We got him! Oh my god, we got him, we got him, we got him! We got him! Oh my god, I don't believe it! I don't believe it, man! That's so amazing! Oh! Oh! Oh man, hell yeah! That's so- I was not expecting that, man! Oh! Oh! The luck this episode has just been unreal. We get the Warhammer and Ranger Boots, baby! Oh, I'm doing a little dance. I've decided I'm going to end the episode on a crescendo like that. Just super excited, guys. Just super excited. I'm a bit mo more motivated to go back to Cerberus now so I can get my last crystal from him. Hopefully, I don't pull a Mr. Mammal and I can actually get it in a reasonable amount of time. But I, I kind of didn't want to do him before because I didn't have the Ranger Boots and I thought it'd take me years to get them, so... I made a little list of items that I want, R namely Magic Fang, more Zenite jewelry of any sort of visage would be nice because I don't have any of them yet, and a dragon pick. Other than that, it's all like God Wars items. I really want to have like a really pretty massive uh, supply pool for God Wars. I don't want to just run in there willy-nilly and not be able to stay there to really crush out and grind out some items, you know? It may actually be about time for me to spend my Slayer points on unlocking boss tasks, because that would make things like Armadil and Bandos quite a bit easier. I'm just so jazzed up, you guys. I can't believe it. Can't believe it. I would like to get some more skilling in the coming episode. I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to do for that, though. If I want to be doing more God Wars, for instance, I'll probably want to... Do a little bit more fishing as well as herb lore. Options for that would be training some hunter at herbivore. I'm just trying to make sure I do my farm runs. Not exactly sure what you should expect in the coming episode. Some sort of bossing. I'll probably be back at Sire because that was so much fun. I'm just going to keep letting the wind guide me here. It seems to be doing me, doing me right. Thanks a lot for watching, you guys. Really appreciate the kind words and 
stream and on a few videos I've had. Feel free to let me know what you think. If you have any suggestions or any criticism, just lay it on me. I promise you I can take it. Thanks, thanks again. Thank you so much. I got Warhammer and Ranger boots. I can die happy. I don't want to die, though. Really, though, I don't want to die. Have fun scaping, guys. It, this was a great week. Great, I don't know, five days or something. Hasn't been very long since the last episode. Just had great luck!